Hi guys, today I have this absolutely beautiful wooden doll's house from Audi to share with you. It's such a beautiful toy. Let me show you from behind. I'm not actually sure how big it is, but it's big and it retails around 30 pounds. That's it. And for a doll's house, that's really, really good value. They often sell it around Christmas time. They have a version every year. So this one is about two years old, but the one they do this year will be identical bar a few kind of tweaks here and there. So let me show you inside this beautiful doll's house. So the first thing it has a workable door, sign of a good doll's house, and we're gonna open the first door up. And then we just pull this and you think that's it, that's the doll's house, but actually you can take the roof off. So I'm gonna do that now. So as you can see, I've taken off the first layer of the roof. And what you can see here is it actually becomes the outside garden. So I can put that just there and it becomes part of the patio. And you can do the uh, same with the other one as well. So that's really good. So it also makes it really handy for storage that you can take that off. So I'm gonna show you some of the furniture inside. So the first thing here is we have the kitchen. So we have a little table and chairs. Don't ask where the other chair is. It is uh, missing in action, no doubt. Then we have a little cooker. If we just move that out the way. So diddy for my big chunky fingers. And inside here we have ah, a little refrigerator. This is really nice. So the pack actually comes, the house comes with two sets of furniture. Sometimes it's included, sometimes you buy the furniture separate. Um, they normally sell an indoor house set and an outdoor garden set, so we have both. We're using probably half of the set at the moment. It does come with a lot of little bits and bobs, some of which, you know, we don't use, but again, your little one might. So we have the stairs upstairs, a little bit wonky. This is the living room, so you can see we've got the cushion, we've got the cute little lamp, and we have one of our figures. So it comes with two figures, um, and you can bend them, mold them. They're not easy to stand up, but um, they are cute to play with. And if we turn the table, let's see, what are they watching on TV? Something very exciting. Okay, let's have a little look up here in the bedroom. So you can see we've got the bed and it comes with a little mattress. Again, we've got another figure and let's see if we can open this with my big fingers. <laughs> we've got a little wardrobe there to store our clothes. So again, let's take a little look at her wooden legs. One thing to note actually is one of our legs fell off um, a different figure and it was really sharp inside. So just a little warning there, but um, my boys are very rough with things. So that was just a one-off, but otherwise they're really nice. Okay, so let's have a look in the bathroom. Um, we have, I think this is a little washing machine. I'm guessing so. We have a loo. There we go. Much, uh, much enjoyed by my boys. We have a sink and then we have a slightly ominous looking um, shower just there. And as you can see inside, there are things painted on the walls as well. Some added little touches. So you've got the loo roll on there. In here, you've got pictures on the wall. And down here, you've got the grill, the utensils and things. And here you've got a mirror and kind of bookshelf. So it sets the tone nicely for the house. Then you go up the stairs and we're in the roof. So what I've done here is I've put some of the outdoor furniture up here so you can see it. We have the roundabout. We have a swing, which, you know, does work, but actually you can't get anything to sit on it. That's fine. Hopscotch, slide. My kids play with that a lot. Our flower pot has fallen over. And you can see there we have a little dog kennel. Dog, where is it? Who knows, it's a mystery. And a little dog bone. I think this is a lovely doll's house. And I have two boys and it was really important for me that I gave them a doll's house still to role play with. Um, I'll be honest, normally there's superheroes in there. <laughs> um, not normally nice little figures, not normally set up quite as nicely as that. Um, but I think it's a really good value doll's house. If you think, you know, your child, whether you're not sure whether they'll like one or not, this is a really good start place um, for one. So I definitely recommend. So it's the Audi wooden doll's house. I hope you've enjoyed this video, guys.